Hey guys, welcome back to the Let's Get Started channel. In this video, I will be showing you 5 more mods that you shall definitely need to try out. Anyway, let's continue, shall we? The first mod I have for you is the Secret Rooms mod. In this mod, there are many secret things that you can use to hide your secret base from other people. Things from the ghost blocks, where you can literally go through them. The camel doors, camouflaged into any block, so nobody can go in, nobody can actually realize. And these glass things. Ooh. Uh, anyway, these blocks actually look like a regular block, like the terracotta here, but the minute you look into this glass side, it'll be essentially look like a glass. But from any other direction, it looks like a regular block. Now, shall we get into the redstone red things? The first one is the torch. Lever. Torch lever. The piston is for show. And then we have the, the lamp button. You see? And finally, we have the redstone chain. It's pretty nice for secrets, but... It is a nice thing for secrets, but I'm generally not one person to like using these secret things. So, I regular I don't regularly use these type of secrets. Anyway, shall we continue? The next mod I have for you is a mod called Give Me Hats. In this mod, it basically allows you to have more hats that look Wacky and weird. I mean, look at this. This just looks funny. If you don't want the walrus hat, you can also add the floaty hat. Which, honestly, to me, doesn't look as nice, but... This one, just very funny. I love it. This is one of my favorites. If you don't like the tip-top hat... Tip-top top hat? Oh, that's a, that's a very fun thing to say. You can also have the Witch's Brim, which is, if I may add, very, very, very nice. Or finally, the Astronaut Helmet. There are also, there are definitely more than this, but these are one of my few favorites. If you don't like any of these, you can also get the Slime Hat. I mean, that just looks pretty funny, if you ask me. And, I won't say much more. Because I want you to go and explore and find the funny, funny hats that you might like. So, shall we continue? My next mod is a mod called Block Shifter. In this mod, I think you can tell what this mod does. It essentially allows you to shift the blocks by moving them up or move them down. Forgive me for the lousy stone, but it's the best I can do at the moment, but anyway, you can do that. And the way you make it move down is by putting a reverse signal on this. And one last thing, if one of them is on and the other isn't, you can't just continuously do this. Because it won't work, you have to turn off the other one before you can turn this on. Which, I will admit, is pretty sad, but it makes sense. And this can be a pretty good generator, no, sorry, uh, excavator, if you think about it. But the redstone will be costly, of course. But it could be a gener uh, excavator, because it could mine out this, it will pull things out. That's one thing I'll say. But then again, it just pushes it out. So you might need a TNT duper or something like that to get rid of it. Anyway, let's move on to the next mod, shall we? In the next mod that I have for you is a mod called Villager Hats. In this mod, you can basically wear cool little hats. Oops. Like this. Look at the butchers. The butcher doesn't really give you much, but the one thing I know is that if you get the villager hat, you'll get the hero of a village. Which I would say is a pretty good deal. Personally, I think my favorite one of all is the eye patch, but unfortunately the eye patch is a bit glitchy. But
But this, personally, is quite cool. But I'll let you decide which one is the nice one, shall I? Let's move on with the next mod. Alright, the final mod that I have for you is called Flora Dumpling. In this mod, you basically can bone meal baby flowers. Now, this needs a little bit of context. In the normal vanilla game, you can basically double any flowers that are two blocks high. But you cannot double anything with a one block height. Now, in this Flora Doubling mod, you basically can do that, but with baby flowers. I mean, isn't that good? You can double them without having to do this. Ah, bone meal, bone meal, give me flowers, bone meal. All you have to do is collect one flower, and you can bone meal for life. I mean, isn't that good? Now I can go plant all my poppies and allium wherever I want without having to carry a bundle. Anyway, that's all I have time for today. Make sure to check out these mods, check out my Discord group, and like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!